Okay, so I just got done streaming. Um, well, actually, not really streaming at all. It was a complete failure. If you watched yesterday's stream or attempted to watch yesterday's stream, you will know that it was a complete failure. And I wasn't able to do it because my internet just seemed to... I don't know break on me but i have an idea of what it was and i want to talk to you guys about how i am kind of using the internet to record and stream and upload while traveling the country which is one of the biggest questions i get while um doing this bus it's like how are you gonna carry on with your youtube channel like how are you gonna make videos and stuff um i think that was stuff coming in with the baby so i'm gonna shut this off and i'll get to it and show you how it is done I think that's the issue right there. There's the antenna. I've put it on top of here because it's got um, magnets on the bottom. It's covered in snow. It's covered in snow. As you can see, this is where the lead goes. This is the antenna lead right here and goes right in there. This AC unit hasn't been hooked up yet, um, but it will be. But yeah, this line, this black line right here that goes in through there is where the antenna goes. So there's like four different types of internet to choose from, right? Um, two of them were automatically cancelled out because we're in a schoolie. We're living in a schoolie and moving around. I'm sorry, the, the, the light is not the best here, but it is winter here in Maine. Um, cable internet, obviously we're moving. That can't be done. The other one is Starlink, something that I definitely looked at. But with Starlink, it has to be in a in a location a specific location you can't be moving with it and i know elon has put a tweet out at one point saying that he wants starlink on boats and vehicles and stuff but i'm not holding my breath it's not something that's probably going to be done anytime soon so the other two options were um, satellite or cellular satellite is a little bit more finicky in my opinion for a moving vehicle um, so i went with cellular i don't really know much about satellite i didn't really want to dive deep into it but with cellular you kind of already know about it because it's on your phone right it's you pay for a certain amount of gigabytes which is stupid it used to be like unlimited gigabytes but now you pay for a certain amount of gigabytes and if you have signal you can use it simple as that um so i went with that because the the route i take which i'll explain in a second gives me way more flexibility so i have what's called a pep wave um, and the specific one i have has room for four sim cards it has to be two different carriers but it has four sim cards so i have two verizon and i have two at and and if you are in the uk or whatever it's kind of like having um two vodafone and two orange right different kind of services you can get um i worked out that through uploading videos i obviously upload gameplay videos which can be upwards of an hour sometimes or a stream which can be upwards of an hour that usually is about 10 to 15 gigabyte per upload and i do that at least three or four times a week there's obviously reactions in there they're a lot smaller uh, but that's at least three or four times a week um on a good week and you know plus you know watching tv with the kids and you know doing all the stuff that i need to do downloading games and stuff like that because i do stream video games um i had to have a lot of gigabytes so i have two verizon i have two at&t's i have um, 300 total of 300 gigabyte verizon and a total of 200 gigabyte at&t so maxing out at 500 gigabyte i also have a few little like i have like 100 gigabyte of tethering on my phone it's not as good si um, a signal um, and that's t-mobile but um it's there if i need it in emergency um, and i think we have a couple of devices with t-mobile on it so we have plenty of gigabytes and what this pep wave does is i'll connect to verizon and it'll connect to at&t at the same time and it'll pop you on verizon if you think that that's got the best service and if it runs out or if it's not that good service you can automatically switch to at&t and it doesn't lose signal it's actually really cool it's a cool bit of kit and what that does is it just helps me kind of monitor how much gigabytes i've got i can go into the back end of the router change the password check out where i am on how much i've got left for the rest of the month um, how fast my speeds are going what the signal likes in the area and depending on that i can adjust right so if we're in an area and there's no at t but there's plenty of verizon i can use the 300 gigabytes of verizon i've got vice versa with at t uh, with the antenna i have a um, 5g a multi-directional antenna on top of the bus which um, you saw earlier when i had some snow on it which is probably why i couldn't stream yesterday um i also have another one which is kind of like in a an emergency like i have to upload a video 
I have to do it soon or I need internet and it's a bit more of a uh, we've got no signal we need to get this done and basically I have a 25 foot telescopic pole uh, with a directional antenna on it and I put that on the side of the bus it goes up 25 foot and I can point it towards a cellular tower and get data that way um, it cost me quite a bit I think the whole setup cost me about a thousand dollars which is probably like 800 pounds I think in England um, but in my opinion obviously the only way we make money my family make money is through YouTube right like I have to have decent internet otherwise I can't upload these videos right so it's important that we do that it's important for our lifestyle and the whole traveling around the country to be able to have the internet and actually work from wherever we go wherever we can it does give us some limitations right so we can't really park up where there's next to no signal um, we can't really park up in a place where we're going to be for a long time and we know we're really going to struggle because I have to drive somewhere and upload which will just be a pain in the butt and I don't want to do that so that is our um, internet setup really I have the pep wave which is connected to the directional the um, omnidirectional antenna which is on the back of the bus um, and then if I have to I can put the directional one on there I have different uh, mobile services that all connect to the pep wave and it's a genuinely fantastic bit of kit it really is um, I'll leave a link down below I think to if, if anyone's interested I know these these videos about my school don't get anywhere near as many views as my gaming videos and stuff but if it's something that you are interested in you are interested in traveling um, and and kind of doing van life or bus life or whatever and you are struggling for internet let me know in the comments and i'll give you the links that you need and we can talk all about it so if you have any more questions um don't, don't hesitate to ask down below in the comment section i can also do oh bit of rain on there i can also do a tour of my actual setup of my um, streaming computer and everything like that and I can also give you a tour of the bus when it's fully done we're still kind of doing the plumbing we mounted the tanks down here but we've got some more plumbing to do um, so if you want that stuff and you are interested let me know in the comments and like this video and I will certainly give you more of that um, other than that members you're awesome I love you um, I will see you in the next video links down below to all my socials if you are interested in more bus life stuff the original adventure channel my second channel has a lot more of when we were building it but also the original adventure original adventure instagram more importantly has more content on it than any of the other platforms with uh, the schooly stuff so links down below to them show socials check them out if you're definitely interested in schooly stuff and uh oh god i'm so excited i'm so excited we're gonna be going down to florida in the new year hopefully new year's day we're going down to florida i'm so excited guys i might even see you guys on the road take it easy everyone peace